Ryan Shazier from Full Island, Florida, with the Plantation High School. Uh, I work number 10. Um, I plan on majoring in computer engineering, but I'm still a sport right now. Um, my, 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 my little while in high school, I've been, having, I've been pretty good. Have, um, learning a lot of new players, having a good I'm just having a good time, enjoying my new family and everything. Um, does anybody have any questions? You said, I think, in the spring that it was a little bit of tough at first when you first got here to make that transition. Has it kind of slowed down for you? Has it become easier? Yeah, um, everything's become easier. Um, I'm learning a lot more about the position and everything. And I have some great guys in front of me that's teaching me and everything. It's, it's, it's a lot better now. As far as the position goes, what are you fitting in best at? Where do you kind of see yourself out there on the defense? Um, right now, I'm learning all of, all of the linebackers right now, Mike, Will, and Sam. But um, I just got to see whatever the coach feels for me at, and whatever is best for the team, that's what I'm going to play. you feel more comfortable in any of those spots? Uh, right now, most comfortable at Sam, but um, the coach might move me around so I can see what, what he wants me at. When you look, is that, is that where there's a real opportunity to possibly even start this year? I mean, at Sam, I mean, do you, do you sense that? It, um, I have to see how everything goes through camp. Just keep working hard and practicing and, and doing what I have to do. But if, if I go hard and whatever is possible, you know, I might I don't know for sure. You know, your position coach when you came in is now the head coach. Did, do you have to call him a different name now? No. <laughs> What's that like? What's it been like for you, Ryan, to kind of process all that? I mean, you know. Um, one thing, I, I, I'm actually excited for Coach Flipper because I know he always wanted to be a head coach and for the great University of Ohio State. And he recruited me, and he's one of the main reasons I came here. I love Coach Trust as well, but I, I'm really excited for Coach Flipper, and I'm really excited for this season. And with that said, your new coach is Mike Vrabel, <laughs> three-time Super Bowl winner, et cetera. What, what's the little bit of interaction you've had with him? What's been your impression, and um, what's he told you he expects out of it? Uh, he expects great <coughs> out of all of us and toughness and everything. And, um, Get turnovers, and he, he told me that he expected that out of all of us in this uh, fast football. But I'm really excited because I've heard a lot of stuff from the three weeks that he has been here and everything. And, um, like some of just the simple things he just taught me, it, it, it makes a difference. Yes, I really like having him as my new coach. Also, remember how cold you were during the spring? You happy with this warm weather? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm happy with the warm weather. Uh, it's starting to feel like Florida. It's too much like Florida. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. All right, thank you. Steve. <clears throat> How y'all doing? I'm Steve Miller. I'm uh, from uh, Canton, Ohio. I went to uh, Canton Killing. My jersey number is 88. Uh, I'm undecided with my major right now. You now, one thing I probably have to say about this first month, uh, uh, I had a lot of fun with all my teammates. We, uh, we bond a lot. I think. This is a good class this year. Uh, any questions? I mentioned earlier about uh, you know, referring to you know, new family. And do you get that family type of atmosphere with your teammates? How close are you guys? Uh, we, uh, we real close. We hang out like 24-7 to everybody go to sleep for real. <laughs> <laughs> we, heard, uh, we heard that you were one of the jokesters of the freshman class. Is that accurate? <laughs> Uh, yeah, a little bit, a little bit. I just, just put a smile on everybody's face. Make sure everybody happy. you. Steve, you're one of the guys who's wearing the JT wristbands. Can you talk about why you wear it, why that's important to you? Uh, I wear it because, man, he was a good guy to me. He was uh, pretty <coughs> strong. Uh, it means a lot to me coming here. He had uh, recruited me strong, so that's why I wear it. I miss him. Is that something that you guys do all season? Uh, the wristbands? Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Who came up with the idea? Oh, uh, no, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, yeah. Where'd you get the wristband? Did uh, I hand it to you one day? or? No. <laughs> uh, one of uh, somebody on the staff gave it to me. What do you think of your class of defensive, defensive line the <coughs> freshman class? What do you think the potential is for you guys? Uh, I think the potential is hard. I think you've got the ability do a lot of good things for sure. And one player who's 7 on 7 or whatever, you know, the stuff you guys, linemen get to do, who's impressed you since you've been here? Today? Um, I mean, impressed me. yeah, upperclassmen, freshman, whatever. What, what, who's one guy who kind of surprised you about how 
Uh, I'll probably have to say like Danny Simon. That dude, he a uh, fast with the ball. He's a fast period. So, Anything else? Can you hold up your wrist, the wristband, so we can see it? Yeah. Turn it on. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Steve. <laughs>